there's more than just seven on seven football action going on in Carroll County this summer. The county's boys and girls soccer teams are in action during the month of July at Coppermine Four Seasons in Hampstead. League nights are Monday for the boys and Tuesday for the girls. One of those girls teams is Century, county champion in each of the past five seasons. The Knights had 13 seniors in their 2023 squad that advanced to the Class 2A state quarterfinals. With the first day of fall sports tryouts on the horizon, a new crop of players have been using the summer to mesh as teammates and hone their skills. We've had a lot of new freshmen come out and a lot of underclassmen that are coming back out, which is good. And we have a lot of numbers and we've all just been getting to know each other and getting to know our playing style. We already are building our team chemistry so soon. Like even before the season starts, we're already getting to know one another and how we play with each other again, especially after last season. We have got a lot of new girls coming this season, so we're looking at how they play. We've been doing summer leagues, summer camps, and lots of summer workouts, so we're getting ready. Century coach Chris Little said the 7-on-7 seven -seven Summer League is a great way to get a look at what the future holds for his program and what the upcoming 2024 season might look like in a few months. You know, usually for the 77s, we get a lot of the younger kids playing, so we're just trying to learn a little bit about our younger freshman players and uh, where they might fit in and play a role, uh, you know, for both programs. The Soccer Summer League features 19 girls teams and 14 boys teams, and games run through the end of the month. After that, it's a few weeks off before the first day of tryouts, which is set for August 14th. Consider this a great time for county soccer standouts to prepare for whatever comes at them down the road this fall. I expect us to compete really hard, and I know that we're going to come out and we're going to work really hard. We're going to put a lot of good results together, and we have a lot of great returners, and we have some good rising seniors who will step into the leadership role. I think that after last season, we're going to come out strong, and we're going to come out wanting it. I expect that we're going to compete hard this season. Want more local sports coverage? Be sure to like us on Facebook and subscribe to our YouTube channel.